uh, one of the things that you need to get a service test running, the first is a service test portal. That's the whole point. So this is the kind of first thing you need to understand, that Jira service test runs on top of core Jira. So if you guys are using Jira, it's still a Jira project underneath. It's still got workflows and custom fields and screens and schemes, unfortunately, um, for those who have tried using them. Um, it's still a project, but it adds an extra layer on top. And think of the portal like a presentation layer, really, that runs on top of your Jira project and lets people who don't know anything about Jira, don't even know what Jira is, it lets, gives them a way of opening tickets in Jira in a nice kind of pretty way. Never underestimate the power of pretty. The first big change about the portal is the licensing, because in Jira Service Desk, you do not need a license in order to open a ticket. You only need licenses, an agent license, to actually work on a ticket from behind the scenes. So that's really good. So that means you can have 20,000 people opening tickets, and you can have one very tired agent, but very cost-effective agent, at the back running them. So that's the kind of first big change uh, with Service Desk. It's the only addition or, or plug-in, as it was, that's, that's um, works in that way. So we've got a portal here. Uh, this is a, an IT service desk one. So I can come in and do some, I want to, some IT help. Um, how does your service desk work? Seems like a reasonable question. And I'm going to create my ticket. Now, the great thing about this is it gives this portal, um, I'm logged in with my username or my, uh, my email address. And I can see all my existing so I can see my ticket I've just put in. I can see what stage it's in. It's waiting for support and waiting for them to do it. I can comment on it. I can add more attachments. And I can see all my open requests and see what stage they're at. So it's a great, it's not just a way of logging tickets. It's actually like an interactive account that I have set up that lets me manage my tickets. And that's fantastic, um, especially when it doesn't cost anything in terms of a license. Um, so in here, I can see my requests. I can share. I can go back and comment. Fantastic. So. We need a portal. You can obviously customize this portal as well. You can put, change the colors. You can change these, um, the graphics and things. You can put your logo on it. Um, and for those who want a slightly higher level of customization, keep your eyes peeled. And